this video or rather this slideshow is part of the community based service project which took place at M Guideni Technical High School from the 14th to the 18th of July 2014. Most of the government schools, especially in the townships and rural areas, are faced with different kinds of challenges, some of which eventually lead to the teachers failing to complete the prescribed syllabi on time. These challenges include great numbers of learners in the classrooms and shortage of teachers. This leads to some dedicated schools giving extra classes on weekends and also during the school holidays in order to catch up with the work for the sake of their matriculants. M. Kaideni Technical High School is one of the best schools in Kwambonambi area, that is in Richards Bay, KZN, which was identified as also experiencing such difficulties. It has dedicated and passionate teachers who are willing to go an extra mile in preparing their matriculants for excellent achievements as their metric pass rate records reflect. They currently have four metric classes with a total number of 140 learners. As part of the JCP project, I approached the principal of the school, Mrs. Nchangase, requesting to offer an extra hand in their good efforts, as I have already explained. It was the day before the closing date for the school holidays, and I must say I was welcomed with warm hands. Matric teachers had already scheduled these extra classes for the week before school reopening. I was introduced to Mrs. Tembe, math teacher, and Ms. Ndoli, physical science teacher, and together we planned the work and divided the classes amongst ourselves in a way that would be most effective since we would only have one week together. On my first day, I had already told myself to keep my calm and prepare for whatever behavior I could possibly encounter from the learners. I kept wondering what their reaction would be having another student in front of them as their teacher especially recalling how we also gave teachers hard time back in the days. But to my surprise, the Mkaiteni metric learners showed so much discipline and maturity. Even during the contact sessions, they showed so much enthusiasm and positive attitude towards all we did. I took them for mathematics and they proved to be well old machines. For me, the whole experience was so much fun and I enjoyed every moment of it. And towards the end of the week, even those who had had negative attitude towards math and further tertiary learning were very much motivated. The teachers were also most grateful for the assistance I had rendered. In concluding, I would say that the objectives of the project were met, hence the project as a whole was a success.